Hello, this is Chaos Balloon. Welcome back to more Let's Play Final Fantasy VII. Last time we got thrown into the desert prison. And this time we're going to do stuff in the desert prison. M mostly involving trying to get rid of Kate Safe as quickly as possible. Um, so yeah, let, let's see how that works for us. Uh, why are you following me? You're annoying me. No kidding. Okay. Let's, uh, let's save. Damn it, Casey. Okay, so where the hell did Barrett go? These guys, those guys only tell lies. Only lies. None of them will tell you the truth. So here's the thing. There are enemies here. We actually want to fight a few of them. Because we can get a few enemy skills. Uh, oh, you know what? I need to change around my rows. I forgot to do that. But, uh... Oh yeah, these face things are actually really fun to fight. They do that, or I think the other head is Fire 3? But I don't really remember for sure. Okay, yeah. Um, you need to be on the back row because I gave you long range. This place is heaven. 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 Never heard of him. Heard of him. Heard of him. Go southwest. So, south, opposite of southwest is northeast. Obviously. You must be a chocobo rider to take the elevator to the top. That's that's the way out, incidentally. Uh, yes. Yes, I do. Who, indeed? Hmm. What's in here? That's not a good sound. Oh, it's Barret! I mean, it's a little late. We're already in the damn prison. Oh. Who the hell is that? Oh, hey, it's the rest of them! <laughs> the best things. That is totally something Cloud would say. <laughs> that asshole. Uh, yeah. That was good. Thank you for just saying it, Red. Oh, that's interesting. I remember I was on my way home from a visit to the Mecha Reactor. On your way home from when your village was destroyed by Shinra. Yep, that that's on fire alright. Very much on fire. Wait, you're coming home from the Shinra react or from the Mako reactor? Are you responsible for blowing the thing up? I didn't think you were. Hey Barrett, it's not over yet. Everyone's waiting. Okay, yeah, he just got shot. That's actually kind of kind of hilarious. Not only the dancing, but also their truly terrible aim. Yeah, that was Scarlet. I mean, yeah, you're right. 
They have terrible aim. <laughs> she is a terrible boss. Oh, well, he fell down. Barret's prone. They're, I mean, sooner or later, they're going to get hit like this. Ah. And that's how Barrett lost his hand. I guess. Yep. He was depressed, so he had a gun surgically mounted to his arm. But you're not the only person who had the exact same idea. Because, you know, obviously, the the logic is, get your arm shoot, shot off, become depressed, attach gun to arm. Hmm. I see. Okay. Can I... Can I... Can I take, like, the shit off Katesy first? Okay. Okay. We're good. I can do this. Take everything off of Katesy, because fuck him. He's terrible in every way. Although I'm going to need to re-equip some- Damn it! And then I can take Aerith with me like I want. Although I should probably take Yuffie, but you know, I'll use y Yuffie after this. I I'm tired of, y of the yuffie bear combo. Um, equipped? The... Sure, that one. Let's see now. Do that, and I guess there's a bunch of stuff I want to level up. Wait, I I should give I give these to Aerith. Well, it might be better to give these to Barret. Uh. Oh, you know what I will do, actually? I'll give you an enemy skill. Then I guess I'll put... Sure. You can have that one. And... That one. And... Earth, maybe? Or poison, perhaps? I mean, I would prefer to use this, but I don't really have the slots for it. So... Yeah, we'll go with poison. Okay then. Okay then. On that note, what is what is here? Is there anything back here? Oh, there's... Well, yeah, actually there is. It's a bar. The Desert Prison Bar. Pub. Bar and breakfast. <laughs> okay, what are you selling? Nothing I care to have. Okay, well, that was interesting. I want to see what's in that truck. Uh, okay. Are you guys bandits? I hate you. In fact, Chocobo! Kill them all! I get better the enemy skill that doesn't have any enemy skills. Hmm. Maybe I didn't think that one all the way through. Look, oh, okay, that's the other thing they do. They self-destruct. Oh, wow, that did a lot of damage. But I'm not letting one of those duck bastards steal from me. Again. 
No, the last time was quite enough. <laughs> so, what's down here? Like, there's a red arrow- wait. I did not even realize I could go in here. Wow. Okay. I'll take it! I found a free- well, I mean... It, that's in in air quotes, but I found a free in. And I managed to ditch Kate Seath in the same episode! I am so happy. Okay. Now, yes, I'm still interested, and no, I still don't know who the boss is. Fine. Okay, so... There are a few things I want to do down here. But I... Before I do them... There's actually a few specific enemies I want to fight, which these are not them. No, these are the enemies I hate because, well, because they will try to steal from me. <gasps> FAT CHUKUMO! WE DID IT! So remember when I was talking about the alternate summon for Chocobo? Well, there it is. That has a pretty low chance of appearing, maybe 1 in 12. It deals more damage than the regular Chocobo, but it does not, um, what's the word? Uh, it doesn't inflict stop, though. Okay, uh, did I see that? Hmm. And now that, and... Now that I've given it some thought, it's not actually the only summon that has two different uh, possible attacks. I can think of at least one other one that is like that, although for very different reasons. Hmm. Okay, Cloud is actually faster than Aerith right now. Go figure. Okay, yeah, you do that. I'm happy to be cured, threed. Uh, ice leveled up. That's good. But I'm still not finding the oh hey. This guy appears to be dead. But I need to fight like... There's two enemies that I need to actually fight down here, and I've run into ni neither. Ugh. You know what? Oh, uh, you know, I could just use Matter Magic. Let's do that. You do that as well, just in case you don't kill him. Aw, oh, man, I'm actually really glad that I got off the, uh... The Chocobo Mach, though. The Fat Chocobo. Because, like, I have had games where that just- where you just don't see it. Because it is- I mean, like, if you use Chocobo and Mog enough, you're eventually going to see it, but... Chocobo Mog itself, it's literally the first summon of the game you get. Eventually, we'll get to the point where it's just not that good anymore. Okay, so I'm gonna do something dangerous. Incidentally, we're eventually gonna want to be over there. But, well, let's do this. That's interesting. So anyway, we have walked off into the desert. Now, if I backtrack here, I believe, nope. Nope, <laughs> we're stuck. Oh, hey, I forgot about that. There we go. Get me stuck in the damn desert like I'm trying to do? Come on, dude. Oh yeah, that's that's gonna hurt. Although it's a great way to build up limit breaks. Um. Okay. Fire, not very effective. Good to know. Heal everyone, please, Aerith. Oh, you know, I could have used her limit break for that. That would have been better. Oh well. I'd rather you see a Leopold anyway. 
for the potential kill. Wait, this does deal damage, right? I feel like I, I should really know this by now. No, that totally didn't deal any damage. But it didn't flick stop, which is gonna make it a lot easier to kill this. I wonder if you have anything to steal, actually. You do. I wonder what it is. I mean, I've inflicted stop on you, so I'm not a turbo either? Oh, well, that's actually really good. Probably can't steal a second time, though. Yeah. Oh, I, I, I keep accidentally stealing. I need to actually pay attention to what I'm doing. Can, can you just... There we go. So, yeah. That is one of the enemies you can only fight out in the desert. It is worth a fair amount of XP, and you can steal good items from it. But no, what I'm really, what I'm really after is the other enemy that I can fight in the middle of this damn desert. Also, I'm hopelessly lost now. I cannot possibly, I can't walk back to where I came from. The only way to go is to keep moving forward. Okay, hopefully. I'll come on. Just, just let me fight it. Pretty please. Huh? Huh? Oh, what? I found another freaking. Okay. Where the hell am I? Oh, hey. These are actually all the things that I wanted to fight for my enemy skill purposes. Um. Okay then. Let's try to steal, because I don't actually want to kill them until they have used enemy skills on me. Do I have sense on someone? I don't think I do. Oh! Okay, I just got laser. That's one of them. But that was on Barret. I need to get it on Aerith as well. Oh! And that was the other one, Matcher Magic. Don't need you anymore. I mean, I already had Matcher Magic on one of my enemy skills, but not on both. Now I have it on both. Let's see... I mean, I may as well kill one of you. Hopefully use laser on Aerith, though. That would really be ideal. But yeah, I actually don't want to be here. I don't know how the hell I managed to get... arrive here from... Oh, okay, that did it. I mean, I seriously, I have no idea how the hell I got here. Because I shouldn't have been able to get here from how I was wandering through the, through the desert. Like, it actually shouldn't have happened. So... But hey, at least I got those enemy skills I wanted. You do have barrier. I mean, I should probably actually use something else. Okay, incidentally. The laser skill. It basically works the same as Demi. It's gravity magic. It deals a percentage of... I think it might be... I'm actually not sure if it's my total or current life. But it is percentage damage. On a single target. Which makes it really good against enemies that are not immune to it. Uh... Which is quite a few of them. So I don't I don't want to be here. Somehow I'm back here. Okay. Sure, whatever. Uh yeah. That that was weird. That whole sequence where I was in the desert, then I wasn't in the desert anymore, that should not be possible. I uh That area where we were is where we want to go. But not where I want to go. Because I want I still want to do stuff in the desert. Okay. Can we... I mean, I'll tell you right now, this is probably going to be a somewhat un interesting few screens. I'm going to find at least one enemy. Oh, we got it! It's a Cactar! Cactar will run away really quickly, and it's immune to most elements, and also it has nothing to steal. But it won't use Thousand Needles, because for, even though it totally has that ability, like if we, if we could hit with ma Manipulate, we could totally make it use Thousand Needles and learn enemy skill like that. But at the same time, it's basically impossible to hit. 
unless you use a non-elemental one guaranteed hit move. You don't get any AP or XP from this either. But you get ten thousand gil. This is the this is the money making thing I mentioned a couple episodes ago. I wouldn't really call it a trip either, but it's definitely nice. Of course, you also of course. These worms are way more common than cactus are. I wonder if you're immune to laser, actually. Let's find out. You are not, but that didn't actually deal that much damage. I am... I'm kind of disappointed. Uh... No, actually the cloud can use freaking cure. You can... I don't want to summon you. Match your magic? Eh? Eh? Sure. Go for it. Did... Did that just deal no damage? No, it must have dealt some damage. And now every... Oh no, Cloud doesn't actually have slip break, does he? Damn it, Cloud! You're the one person who actually benefits from spamming Limit Breaks right now. Come on, dude. Whatever. Okay, so at this point, I'm basically gonna just wander in further into the desert until I run into an event. So, I think I'll just cut here until I reach it. Um... It can take a while to hit it. You can either get it right away, or you can. It can take a while to hit it. It's it's random, as far as I know. So I'll see you when I find it. Oh hey, we found it! If you wander into the desert far enough, you will eventually run into a chocobo cart, which I suggest you get on, because it's the only way you're going to get out of the damn desert. This is basically the mercy button. Um, it brings you back to the desert prison, if you're wandering into the desert. But it's actually, as I've sort of shown, it's actually not a terrible idea to wander in the desert, because it's a really good way to grind up limber breaks. Uh, having, I literally fought a single cactar while I was in there. Man, that, that was kind of, oh well. Still. I have way more money than I did when I went in. And Barrett's Limit Break, which is going to be relevant quite shortly. Heal me! No, I'm just gonna use Cure. Okay, so, I'm gonna go to the... go rest. And then, after that, I think I'm gonna go do what I'm actually supposed to be doing. You know, instead of wandering through the aimlessly through the desert. I wish you had done that to someone other than Barret. Oh, come on! Oh, hey, that's percentage damage. I did not know that. Cool. Anyway, so, I'm, having said all that, I'm going to stop off here. Join me next time when we attempt to escape from the desert prison. Until then, this has been Chaos Blue, and have a great day. Bye!